subscribe for vlogmas hello guys welcome to or welcome back to my channel today i have a very very exciting video that i've literally been waiting to film forever pretty much all year honestly today i'm going to be wrapping all of the christmas presents that i bought for other people slash showing you what i got for people for christmas instead of doing it what i got for christmas i may do one we'll see it all depends really i don't know we'll see i literally love wrapping christmas presents it's just so satisfying i love watching people wrap christmas presents so this is a very exciting video for me um I'm stoked. <laughs> also, obviously, if you are my boyfriend, if you are my family, please don't watch this video. I'm gonna say that once. Don't watch this video or else you're gonna ruin it for yourself. Really up to you, but I wouldn't watch it if I were you, okay? <laughs> I just made myself some green tea with peppermint and honey. I have my laptop so I can watch some videos while I wrap. And yeah, I'm just gonna, I have a huge box of things that I need to wrap. And I'm gonna show you exactly what I got for people and for my boyfriend, especially because it is his birthday on Christmas Eve, which means double the presents for him. Yay. <laughs> but it's always something I struggle with because I have to either get him really good big presents or a lot of really good small presents. This year I did pretty good. I think I'm very excited about what I got. So I hope this gives you some ideas too. Even though this video is going to be up probably Christmas Eve, so it might be too late, but I don't know. I just hope you enjoy this video as much as I am going to. But yeah, we're gonna start off. I think I'm gonna do my boyfriend's gifts at the end because there are a lot. Um, and I'm gonna wrap all of the other gifts first. I have all of the gifts except for one, which is for my mom. My mom never, just like a parent, never tells anyone what they want for Christmas this year. I finally got something out of her. So I got her some new Converse because she wears just like the basic black Converse every single day. So I got her a new pair of those and they said they were gonna be delivered today. And now I checked the tracking and they say they're gonna be delivered on the 28th. So she's gonna get a little late Christmas present. So I'm obviously not wrapping that in this video, but I am gonna give her something else too, just so she can open it on Christmas. So yeah. So something my siblings do, since there are so many of us, we do Secret Santa instead of getting presents for every single one of us because like I said, there are a lot of siblings in my family, um, like with spouses and all that, so they really just want you to spend money on their kids and not them. So we do Secret Santa. I got my sister-in-law, my brother's wife, Kendra, so I got her two things. We had like a $50 to $100 limit, so I got her some nice white slippers. These are from Amazon. Honestly, I kind of want these for myself, not gonna lie but they're really cute the packaging is not very cute so i'm gonna take it out of the packaging and probably wrap it separately Ooh, they are so soft aren't these so cute so cute and then i also got her a necklace from the same etsy shop that i get my name necklaces from i think it's literally so cute so she has two kids well one right now leah if you don't know her and then she's also expecting um in like a couple weeks or a week i got her a necklace like a gold plated necklace with their initials on it so there is an l and an a for her two babies with a little heart in the center let me try to show you and these are like the good quality like non-tarnish necklaces the ones that i have specifically so you can wear them in the shower and you can wear them in the water and they don't tarnish which which is amazing so this is what it looks like so so cute i think she's gonna really like it honestly she's like probably one of the hardest people to shop for in my family so i'm really excited for her to see this because it is so cute and it has the new baby's initial on it also what could be better but this is going to be a little difficult to wrap because it's so tiny i might just leave it in here honestly yeah i think i'm gonna leave it in this little package and then wrap the slippers separately Perfect. Oh my gosh, let me show you the three wrapping papers I got. I'm a sucker for matching wrapping paper. I found these at Target. They're like, it's a black and white theme this year, I guess. But this one is just black with white snowflakes. This one is white with fa la 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 on it. And this one is like this really textured white. I don't even know how to explain it, but it's like 3D, like fluffy. I don't know, but I'm very excited about it. So I have those. And then I also got some twine as like ribbon to wrap around it. So I'm going to do that. And then I got two gift bags for the things that are kind of harder to wrap, but nothing's going to fit in here. So I'm just going to wrap them. I also have some tape, obviously, and then some gift tags. So I think we're all set to get started. I'm very excited. I think I'm going to go for this wrapping. She's a very white aesthetic 
type of gal, so let's go with this one. Ooh, this is so weird. Very, very strange wrapping. My heart's been ripped wide open. So many mixed emotions. It's like I finally noticed. Okay, honestly, this is very cute. I love the color combo and the twine makes it look so cute. Okay, this is done. Yay, first present done. Okay, next I think I'm gonna do my mom's little gift. So I have this candle from Bath & Body Works. Vanilla Snowflake. I got it for myself, if I'm gonna be honest. And I like it, but I'm not the biggest fan. And I know she loves, loves, loves scents like this. So I'm just gonna give this one to her as a little replacement gift until her real gift comes in. But I really know she'll like this. So I'm gonna give her this. And I'm also gonna put it in this really, really pretty white sparkly gift bag because I really don't like wrapping candles because they're just so awkward. And this gift bag is so pretty. The one thing though that I forgot to get was tissue paper, which is sad. But this is gonna go in here and once I get tissue paper, it'll be complete complete But this is what it looks like literally so cute Okay, so next I'm gonna do my dad's gift and I'm gonna be kind of quiet because he's here So Shh. I got him three little things because him and I are both obsessed with our espresso machine So I got him three things like for that basically first thing is just this random little it's called a tamper mat So it's like a silicone mat that you can use um to make your espresso on top of instead of doing it like on the hard counter so i got him this and then i got him this coffee art book it's basically latte art and like tells you how to make a bunch of different designs and you better bet i'm gonna be using this too but i know he's gonna love it because since he is out of work right now um he's spending a lot of time at home and he has a lot more time to make really cool latte art coffees that he's always wanted to do so i got him this also which is so cute and then lastly i got him this thing called a knock box if you have an espresso machine you get it if you don't you probably are like why do you need that but this thing is probably so essential we just like bang our tamper what's it called basket this thing, the thing that you put co coffee grinds in. We bang it on the trash can to get all the extra grinds out and that's like so bad, especially because we have a like electric trash can that like is automated, like opens with the sensor. So I feel like every time we smack it on the trash, it kind of breaks the trash can a little. So this is called a knock box. It's literally a mini trash can for your espresso grinds. So it has like a metal pole in the middle so you can bang it on there and they can fall in here. I think this is gonna be so cool. So very excited about this. So I'm gonna wrap these three things together and hopefully he likes them. <laughs> Okay, this is my present for my dad. So cute. I just used the twine to put it all together. But I used each of the three wrapping papers and they look so cute together. So, very adorable. Very happy about this. <laughs> if you know me, you know I have a bajillion nieces and nephews. And obviously, as their auntie, I had to spoil them. So I got them each a lot of different things. So... This was on one of their wish lists. It's like a doctor playset, so it has a bunch of doctor-y things like a coat and just a bunch of a bunch of utensils. Utensils? I don't know the correct verbiage for that. Wordage. I don't know the correct wordage for that, but it's a doctor set. It has a bunch of doctor things. And that's for Aiden. We could stay out late until the sun sets past eight and the cotton candy haze the warmth of your gaze raise your glass to my and then for riley i got him a pj set because if you don't know he's obsessed with excavators and like trucks and stuff um because of blippy so i got him this cute pj set with an excavator and then the pants have excavators all over them and I'm literally so excited for him to open this because he's literally going to be so excited and he's almost two years old and I know he's going to be ecstatic about these excavator PJs and I'm just pumped. I am honestly so pumped. Sweet, how can it be such a piece of cake? And your smile is the icing, loving you is a part, it's sweet. 
And then for my niece Haven, she loves coloring and coloring books and she's also almost two. They're like the same age. She's the same age as Riley, um, a day apart, but I got her these like twisty crayons. And these ones are really cool because you can like dip them in water so they can become watercolor pens too, which is really cool. But so many colors. She always, well the ones she has always breaks. So I got her a new thing of those and then she also loves animals. This is 100 animals for toddler coloring book and it has so many cute pictures and i know she's gonna be so excited and like i said she's almost two and she's gonna be so excited for this many times before you've been told so many times before so i'm gonna try you so For Mia, who is my seven-year-old, eight, seven, I think she's seven, <laughs> my seven-year-old niece, I got her a karaoke microphone, it's like a kid's rose gold, big thing, so she loves karaoke, um, and she always uses my dad's like real karaoke machine, but that's here, so when she goes back home, now she has her own to annoy the house with. <laughs> Santa baby, a 54 convert. And then lastly for Leah, who is my four-year-old niece, she loves unicorns. So I got her this unicorn LED light for her playroom, which is really cool. It's like a pink unicorn light, self-explanatory. And then I also got her these unicorn socks, which you can't really see right now, but they're really cute. Like, they're really cute colors. They're not like obnoxious rainbow unicorn socks. They're like all cute colors and they're so cute because they're so tiny and they all have different unicorns on them. So she's gonna love those so much. Okay, I just finished wrapping all of the kids' presents. Literally so many. So many. But they literally look so cute, so I'm so obsessed. But now it's time to wrap my boyfriend's presents. I don't know which ones I'm going to give to him on his birthday and which ones I'm going to give to him on Christmas yet. Or maybe we'll open them all on Christmas Eve. I don't really know what the deal is yet, but I'm going to show you. So the first thing, like probably one of the most exciting things, I customized um, some AF1s for him and he doesn't have any AF1s but he knows my obsession and I just feel like he needs some really good quality shoes. So I normally get him shoes every year but this year I chose to go a little above and beyond and get him some AF1s that are customs. Just really nervous about the sizing because he's normally at 11 but I know AF1s run a little big. Mine run like a full size big or even half size so I just sized down half a size for him so I got him a 10 and a half. I really hope they fit but the box says Nike by Lauren which is so cool. Let me show you what they look like. I'm so excited for him to open these. I'm only going to show you one but they're just white pretty much and then I made the soles black the Nike swoosh black the inside black and then on the back I made the Nike sign red because red's his favorite color and then I put his initials KW on the back I think these are really cute like I would wear these myself and I'm very excited for him to open these like very excited they're just so nice and I kind of want to customize them for myself but excited they smell so weird though i remember the first time i opened them and showed my sister i smelled them and they do not smell good but they don't even smell like new like rubber or leather i don't know what it is but it's not good <laughs> so i got him those which i'm very excited about i'm letting go of you i still feel like i'm letting go of you because those were the days Next thing I'm very excited about, I don't really know how I'm going to show you this, but basically it's a custom paint by number kit. So I uploaded one of our pictures together um, to this company called Painted Memory. I always saw it advertised on Instagram and then I was like, okay, I kind of want to get this. So 
Originally, I was gonna paint it myself and then give it to him like fully painted already, but it didn't come soon enough and I don't have the time to paint this whole thing by myself. So it's gonna be a fun little date night activity that we're gonna do together, but I'm so pumped about this. I'm gonna show you kind of what it looks like, hopefully, but it's in this plastic, so I don't wanna open it yet. But it comes in here, as you can see, with the little canvas on the inside with all the little mini numbers. If you can see it, I don't know if you can. And then it comes with all of the paints. So I'm so excited about this. It comes with paintbrushes too. It's gonna to be a very fun date activity, which I'm very excited for. The sweater is done on me. And then the next thing I went to Target and I got him some really cute pieces of clothes just because he doesn't buy new clothes unless someone buys them for him just because he doesn't enjoy like clothes shopping. So I got him some new goodies. These are so cute. I got him two of these. Oh no, just one of these. Um, what are these called? I don't really know. Kind of ribbed long sleeves, I would say, but they're really, really nice quality and they're really thick. So this one's just a little beige one with the buttons, which I think is adorable. And then I got him this one which is even thicker. It's this forest green long sleeve. It's just really thick, good quality. And then I got him these pants, which are so cute color. They're forest green corduroy. <laughs> hopefully he wears these, but they're just corduroy pants. Hopefully they fit him and hopefully he wears them. Those are my two concerns. But I was thinking I can give him these two on his birthday so that he can wear them on Christmas because it's a really cute Christmas outfit, if you ask me. That's just me, his girlfriend, trying to style him. Those are really cute, so I need to wrap all of those. Oh. And he, so exciting. He just got hired with the Orange County, California Fire Department, which I am so, so excited for and so happy for. So he's gonna be going to the academy um, in the spring, like in March. So kind of related, not related, but that's really exciting. So I'm so happy for him. But I got him some Oakley sunglasses. Basically, they're the sunglasses that all the firefighters wear, apparently. It's like the firefighter brand, like tactical sunglasses. So I got him some Oakley sunglasses. Is they look like this. Can't you just picture firefighters wearing these? I can. <laughs> but I got him some of those because he's been wanting new sunglasses. So I hope he likes these ones. It's a really nice day living in the right space. Breathing your face got me feeling so kind of way. Way. Yeah, you're keeping me sane. Got me in my And then I got him some LED strip lights for his car. Basically, you put it like underneath, like so that you can light up your car. This is so cool. I'm so excited for this for him because I want to try it out. It says 16 million colors. You can attach music to it and like control it from your phone, which is awesome. Very excited about that. And then lastly, I'm pretty sure, I hope I'm not forgetting anything. I got him, I'm not gonna open it because it's in this box, but the Manscaped razor set. Basically, it's a razor for down there um, just to keep yourself clean and tidy. And then it comes with some lovely lotion slash wash for your your friends down there too kind of a joke gift but not really because i know he'll actually use it but i think every man should have one i don't know <laughs> finally finished wrapping everything. Everything is literally so cute and I'm obsessed with how it all looks. I know, the aesthetic, am I right? <laughs> but I'm just so blessed to be able to be giving this many gifts this year. Just very, very overall happy and very excited for Christmas and just very thankful for sure. So that is going to be the end of today's video. I really hope you enjoyed watching and enjoyed all the satisfying wrapping montages because I definitely enjoyed wrapping. Wrapping is one of my favorite things to do. Like I'll always wrap your presents if you want me to so just let me know watch me start like a business of traveling wrapper i go to your house and wrap presents honestly gonna consider it because wrapping is one of the most fun things ever for me and i really enjoy it but yeah thank you so much for watching this video i'm probably posting this on the 24th which is christmas eve so merry christmas to all of you happy holidays whatever you celebrate i appreciate you all so much i love you so much and i'll see you in my next video
Bye guys. The rubber band, you'll be the match. I'ma be your fuse. Boom. Painter, baby, you can be the muse. I'm the reporter, baby.